Trump's in the office, dude. Relax. Yeah. Things are going well. <laughs> yeah, dude. You got nothing to be mad about. I don't know what's going on with that, man. With Trump daddy? Yeah, what's happening? He's doing good. He's doing I haven't hey, followed the news. I think he's the best ever? Is he? Is dude? that what's going on? I don't I can't tell. I don't know what's happening. I don't think he's the worst uh I don't think he's Hitler. Mm mm. You can phase yeah, you can phase. I'm not that sure out. if he's Hitler yet. I don't think he's Hitler. A lot of people said he was. Well here's here's the dude, the thing is I don't think he's Hitler yet. It's one of the two things. It's either or actually it's three things. It's either he is Hitler and he's undermining the press and he's trying to like completely manipulate become the entire fascist. citizenry and become yeah. a fascist, which is like <laughs> all right. Sick as fuck. That's one. If he goes fascist, I'm I'm gonna be first in line being like that's sick that you did that <laughs> yeah. you ruined well, the best country in the world and became a dictator dude. well it's, it's funny because you hear about people loving stalin i'm like is this how this shit happens you just slide into it you're like no nah, dude i thought he's pretty fucking sick dude i don't know i don't know what everyone had a problem with yeah for sure that's exactly how it happens that's crazy but then it's like or so that's one scenario or hillary's part of like a child molesting cabal of deep state fucking people you think hillary's part of the that's the other cabal? that's the that's the alternate side of this where it's like nah dude you guys got it all wrong there's a deep state and they're lying and they're stealing people and they sold all the jobs overseas and it's yeah. like and they stole kids out of haiti so you think it's one of those two things because i or, got a good chance or it's, it's fucking definitely neither. exactly or it's neither and then it's yeah, like it's well nothing. what the fuck yeah it's not that's what it is it's neither it's neither and he's just a fucking idiot that's mm-hmm. the president and what who, what about clint clinton yeah just would have been an idiot that's the president (laughs) and yeah if you want to hold politicians to civilian standards most of them are criminals yeah fair enough you know it's like george bush is a war criminal then yeah but no he's a good dude he's a man he's a man i I miss him dude i'm good with a little war i always hear war criminal and i'm like you know it's like what exactly does that entail i think that entails the drone coming up with the drone program and just fucking no not the drone program necessarily but Mm -hmm. yes i mean bombing like weddings and shit (laughs) with robots yeah that's pretty that's a pretty bad crime but like what's a weird that's not like a battle lying lying about anthrax like wmds in iraq that's a war criminal clearly fabricating that to start a war in iraq true that that's war criminal status but it's also like you hear about like the Revolutionary War and Civil War, and it was like Battle of the Bulge, and it was like they got up on a hill and they're like, "All right, we're going to have a war down." And now it's just like, is that a battle technically when like a robot yeah. comes up and just fucking blasts a wedding, and it's just like, <laughs> like <laughs> blasts a wedding, dude. Battle of that the, was the fucking... Battle of fucking the Green Eyes Wedding, dude. <laughs> in the middle, they like just catch it on the electric slide, like, damn, this song's fucking sick. And yeah. It's like, damn, I wonder how many of those started with like. Because I was just at a wedding. Like, you know that moment where everyone's like, come dance, come fucking dance. Like, I don't, every time I dance, it sucks. And they're like, no, come on. And then you, while you're walking out, everyone's like, yes. Yeah. Boom, robot. And then you're just like picking up your wife and her face <laughs> like is her gone. Arm, like, Allah, Allah, Allah. <laughs> yeah, that's a tough life. That's a tough thing. You ever a see sick- like, a, I've seen a couple of wedding videos where the floor collapses. It's pretty what? funny. Like a bunch of fucking Indians are just packed into a fucking dance floor. And they da- they literally so hard that the floor fucking collapses. I wonder if there's a like saying. I wonder if there's a saying died. in India about like not bringing tearing the roof down, dude. They're just tearing yeah, yeah. down the floor, dude. Just bust through the floor. <laughs> yeah, I came up with a sick theory too that so far every single person's agreed with. Like everybody already knew it. True. Trump's autistic. He's definitely something, dude. Look at the way he. The, Trump's autistic. I'm no, calling no. it. Oh, it's official. Dude, did he you acts s- that weird with no booze or drugs? <laughs> it's fair. He's crushing McDonald's on private planes. <laughs> That's so fair. He dude. fucking watch him try to act. Like go watch him from like when he was on WWF. Dude, it's the weirdest shit. That didn't make sense. He got all that money, and they're like, "You can do anything, Donald. What would you like to do?" He's like, "I want to be on WWF. I want to be in an airplane. <laughs> Give me in the fastest airplane with McDonald's." Did you see his uh, his when he addressed people? Was it Hurricane Florence? Yeah. Dude, did you see his like when he like came out of the White House and like addressed the camera? He came out and he was like, "Hurricane Florence is huge, probably the wettest in terms of water we'd ever had." And I was like, "Dude, are you fucking around? Is this a joke?" It, dude, it was pretty fucking funny. Dude, definitely the wettest in terms of water. Yeah, I heard that. <laughs> like, Hell yeah! I heard these ladies today. I was when I was leaving the hotel. Two fucking ladies were in front of me walking up these steps, and I heard them talking about that. And the lady fucked up the quote. She's like, did you hear what he said yesterday? Mm-hmm. It was like, there's more water. It's like, yeah, it's a hurricane, you fucking idiot. Yeah. And the other one was like, I don't even look at what he says anymore. He's so dumb. And I was behind them just like, 
2020. Yeah, that's not what he I'm said. voting. Dude. <laughs> In my head, I'm just like, dude, he would crush you two. Shut up. We all might be He's autistic. An autistic billionaire. We dude. all might be autistic, dude. Every billionaire. That, that might be what the Matrix Elon Musk, is. Full autism. <laughs> dude. D Trump, full autism. Autism's hot right now. Autism's hot as fuck. You take over the world. If you're that, autistic. No, to be tight. If autism becomes so sick that you get like young white kids from the suburbs like pretending to be like how like young white kids used to pretend to be black, how now like people like pretending to be yeah, autistic. Like, I count, I count trains. <laughs> I know all the trains. <laughs> like, no, you don't, dude. You're not autistic. <laughs> you front like you're autistic, yeah, dude. dude. I think we're in. That's the autistic matrix, dude. We're probably all in the. We're probably all kind of autistic. I mean, I guess it's yeah. It's a spectrum. I'm, dude, I'm definitely. I'm, not, I'm fucking not autistic at all. I'm fucking sick. Dude. <laughs> I'm, being I'm, autistic is gay. Being autistic is sick. Dude. No, being autistic, being is, autistic is awesome. Now Every, that I, now that I I've know never Trump, met an autistic person I don't like. Now that I know Trump's autistic, I'm all in. I'm. So, I gotta. I gotta do more research on that. Makes all sense. Have, all Unless, you do is watch him try to make an emotion. Well, yeah, it's watch true. him try to make any. That's facial what he. That's what he does. You go, whenever anything. like they're like Donald Trump, you're my favorite person. He goes. I don't know, though, dude. He has dude. no idea what he's doing. Emotionally, the guy is unplugged. True. Yeah. He is no fucking That clue. was what I was thinking about, too. Like, when he had to go talk about the hurricane, I'm like, this guy has to, like, get into the headspace and pretend to give a fuck about a hurricane. Yeah. Like, I don't give a fuck I about I watched his Flight 93 speech. Did, did you really? The same thing. He just tried to be like, what your families did was amazing. True heroes. <laughs> Never forget about them. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty great on this beautiful Pennsylvania field, <laughs> and then he like pointed like you know that dumb point he, he does. Is. He does a weird. Po- Watch him clap and point at people oh, every time he yeah. walks out to a speech. When people are clapping, he's like, <laughs> <laughs> well, he doesn't like to be touched either. That's like he, crazy German he pubs. Yeah, he only pounds he's people. Clearly autistic. It's good. That's fair enough, dude. I'm definitely gonna be watching him. Like, I, Watch him through that lens, dude, and you'll see. That must be crazy for him too to like go to rallies and have all those people coming out and chanting him. Watch how he what, when when you see him at a rally like that. Watch how he responds to the crowd. He's like, he does all these weird. That's fucking true. Faces. He's also a seven year old white guy. True. I think every white dude <laughs> after sixty is autistic. They're like, autistic and <laughs> swerved in the lane because he was they autistic. Become autistic and gay. Yeah. Every seven year old white guy becomes gay. It this is what f- Bud was trying to avoid, dude. Bud was getting old enough. He could feel he was gay and autistic, and he was just like, you know what? Fuck it. <laughs> he probably like saw some dude's ass in the bleachers. <laughs> he was like, nope. <laughs> oh, fuck. Yeah, man. That's, that is... Trump's <laughs> autistic and gay. <laughs> well, it's funny because I would be like, dude, he's not as dumb as you think. You got And then I watched the hurricane thing, and it was like him being like, definitely the wettest in terms of water we'd ever had. That's autism. It was That's just autism, like, dude. What the fuck is this guy talking about? It- He's he's autistic, dude. I have to find. Dude, I'll show this here. It's so funny. I've, I heard. I heard about it. It's I've, so fun. I watched that and I was like, "What the fuck?" <laughs> yeah, he says shit sometimes where it's just like, "Damn, dude, you are fucking stupid." I as think fuck. he just every time they're like, "You sure you don't want to?" He's like, "Come on, we got it. Let's go. I got a lot yeah. of stuff to do." And he's like, uh, "Definitely the wettest in terms of water. We it's never very had it. wet. <laughs> very wet. We have some of the best people down there. Some of the best first responders. Yeah. Wow, <laughs> incredible. Just amazing. Amazing stuff they've done." And a lot of people don't know this, but Puerto Rico. That's a sick yeah. that's a sick battle right now, being like the death toll in Puerto Rico. Not that many people died. Yeah. He's like, people who dying anywhere down there. <laughs> Which could be valid. He's like, dude, they if they someone just started lumping all the death data in Puerto Rico and like this happened because of Donald Trump, it's like Did it? Yeah, and he's crazy enough to respond to that. I like know. the the politics behind trying to add up a death toll to blame it on him I know. is fucked up. And then he'll do his own study and be like, it was twenty three people. It was only six people. And they were old. <laughs> it's really hot. A lot of them die anyway down there. It's hot. <laughs> yes. Let's call sick, it, dude. dude. Fuck it. it. Uh, sorry. No. I, I know you were doing something sick. I was just, no, I, I, that was my idea. Your that idea was is part of my idea. Like a flotation time. for white dudes to say the N-word. N-word. No, it's not a flotation. This is like tourism. You get to uh, go out on town and be like, what up? And everyone's like looking like, no, no, he's cool. And they show like, like Westworld. He paid, like you paid it kind of it's like, like a Westworld sort with of, bots. Sort of. But like you could pay into it and people, but then, you know, then I woke up out of this flow tank. I was like, that's a fucking bad idea. It's a bad idea. But I did, I did start laughing about the idea of Trump's N word tape just being that him singing along to that YG song. Him, yeah, yeah, You know yeah, what I'm yeah. talking about? Yeah. They're like, we found the tape, and everyone's like, what the fuck? It's dude? just Trump rapping along to something. His <laughs> his numbers would go through the roof. He'd be like, that's the coolest fucking dude ever. But yeah, I mean, this that the point was, shout out Russ, but my last my last uh, session 
was far from productive. I just thought about dude saying the N-word with Mr. It'll T come on back. their side. <laughs> It'll come back. That's a, that's a good thought. <laughs> they got to start catering towards, like, white trash. Like, West Virginia, was there, like, they're attacking this, like, people who like Trump as, like, privileged, like, trust fund babies. That's not the case. They're fucking, they're attacking themselves. Yeah. They need to start focus on, like, dudes who are down at, like, a, just, you drive past a dusty turnpike, and they're just standing out there with a wrench <laughs> waiting for a car. Yeah. That's who they got to start going. They got to find they're... anything on the turnpike where there's a handwritten sign. Yeah. They need to fucking <laughs> yeah. pull over and be like, who wrote that? We got to talk to them. Because they, they keep going at them, like, they're all these, like, like, Wall Street tycoons kids, and it's like, dude, that's not who's fucking voting for Trump. I mean, they are, but yes. Yeah, a that's small. That's a small, yeah. The there's huge, not that many. Exactly. They got to start taking it towards the WT. If the, if the, I mean, if the Democratic Party Once wanted chance, to. chance, they got to get the white trash. got to get the white trash. Trump dad White trash votes. Dude, white trash. Vote, dude. That's a big vote right now. It's bigger than the, uh, the white trash vote. Black vote was, like, swinging Trump's election. White trash vote's going to be huge. When they start, when Democrats start, you know, they obviously run stuff for black people. Did you ever see that? Like, yeah, they do, like, McDonald's commercials and shit? I mean, like, grandma, sweet tea is so sweet. Yeah. You ever see that? Yeah, McDonald's commercials, they went full blackface. <laughs> McDonald's went full blackface. You know how grandma used to make that sweet tea? Dude. Mm, mm, I'm Dude. fucking loving it, y'all. It's <laughs> like, what? Come now get some motherfucking chicken nuggets, you marky ass busters. Dude, when the DNC does, like, white Damn, trash. This is fucking... my second dip, dude. This Ooh. is a two skull episode, dude. You got to skull up. I got to skull up. We're Dude, talking politics. I'm getting scolded. When the DC, when the drink DNC beers, goes for the white trash vote, drink? you want to drink a beer right now? Do you want to drink a beer? Do you Go ahead. Have I'm sorry, beers? I didn't mean to cut you off. I was thinking about burning them. I didn't, so I shouldn't have even said it. Yeah, what are you, you want to get knocked out, dude? <laughs> Shut the <laughs> fuck up. <laughs> keep going, keep going, keep going, man. With no, I was just talking, dude. If, if they wisen up and start getting some, like, if the Democrats start doing some nice white trash commercials, I'll be so fucking pleased. They should. They, dude, they have to. The fact that they're not, it, it's going to crush them. What they're trying to create right now with this, like, like I've, I haven't listened to enough of Alexandria Ortacio Cortez. Yes. But when I hear her talk, it, she she stumbles a lot on her words. It sounds like she doesn't know what the fuck she's talking about a lot. Really? I mean, maybe because it's a lady yapping, <laughs> and I don't like that. <laughs> but no, for real, it sounds like like if it sounds like she'll get fucking crushed by someone that knows what debate? they're talking about. Dude, I mean, because she just goes on with like a platform of like people shouldn't be poor. Yeah. It's like yeah, for sure. Yeah, that's yeah, sucks. that's our policy too. Yeah, for I sure. Mean, yeah. No, that's true. I mean, that'll be. Uh, I mean, dude, say what you will about Trump. He's been. He's been. He hasn't taken a day off, dude. dude he's been you, doing yeah, his no talks. days off. Dude. He's been doing his. Fucking he's running talks. his hour. He's running his hour. He he's getting ready for this these debates. That's going. It's going to be insane, dude. His it's like Rocky too. His hour is sharp right now. <laughs> yeah, it is. I told you I was watching it. He's going to shred Cortez. I've been bro. watching his debates or his his campaigns mm -hmm. he's still he's been campaigning since day one hasn't stopped bro. he literally hasn't stopped going to arenas and just being like are we the best <laughs> <laughs> are we the best or what i'm telling you wow we're really doing it dude uh, well, apparently people are mad right now because his tax thing where everyone got a little boost in their paychecks it's like no one's getting a tax return now <laughs> that's a clear trick dude. <laughs> great trick dude i love it he's very short term <laughs> Every, he's everyone, very in the moment everyone was like fuck yeah dude i got more money in my check i got one and now apparently everyone's filing their taxes and their accountant's like yeah you're not really getting anything back and like what the fuck you just changed everyone from like a zero to a two yeah <laughs> he uh did you watch the state of the union no i didn't see it oh, you gotta watch it is very measured dude he i was, watched i watched the state of the union and was i was it? like fucking damn what he said trump dog was he fucking nose breathing brought it. Was he, he wasn't totally nose breathing but he did have a couple of those <laughs> that's not when bad. he gets real serious he's yeah what we need to do yeah <laughs> uh, apparently it was real measure but they attacked him they were like what they say? It was like, well, yeah, well, why is he so measured? Because secretly, uh... yeah, of course. But it was actually a fucking sick speech. He brought some dudes in from D-Day. He was like, these guys are the that's fucking one of his shit. Yeah, that's one of his top moves to stand behind a vet like that. Yeah. And just be like, what, what a great guy. I mean, wow. He brought in <laughs> a border patrol dude. He brought what? in like, yeah, he was, yeah, he was like, that guy came here illegally. And now he fucking defends our country. It was like, woo. Now he's a fucking coyote. He probably he, gets paid yeah. off. And fucking <laughs> but Alexandria Ortacio Cortez, she showed up. Uh, her and all the other hot babes showed up in all white and sat Stop, together. bro. That's kind of nice. And like, the black ladies had like African sashes on. Sure. The one Who's the one with the fucking... Uh, there's a Muslim lady. She's the first... Uh, I know you're talking about. Yeah. yeah. She was there. At one point, she like hands on fate. Like it was... 
what you were saying about everybody's trying to be a gif. Yeah. Everyone in there was trying to be a meme or a gif. What? It was hilarious. That's... At one point, though, this was a weird part. Trump, Wait, they like, were there at the State of the Union just all in all white? Yeah. But Trump, at one point, was like, under our administration right now, women have the most jobs they've ever had. And that was the first time all those women stood up and clapped. And then they sat back down. He was like, no, stand back up. You're going to like this next one. <laughs> Nailed him. They had to stand up and clap. No. And he was like, "And he was like, this is the most women we've ever had in politics. And they all did that again. And he was like, that's really great. It's really great for you guys. Congratulations. That's really great. Then he went back to his speech. It was fucking like... Oh, my goodness. Yeah. That's I, didn't, I didn't even watch but it. But really, during his speech, when they like stand up clapped, and, you're gonna... and then they all sat down, he's like, no, you guys are going to want to stand back up for this next one. He just Nailed strictly him. deals in power moves, dude. <laughs> dude. He, they Whoa. tried to they tried to show up in like all white as like unity against him, yeah. and he still was like, "What's up, guys? How are you guys? You guys having fun?" Dude, at one point they clapped the whole Congress like clapped for like a veteran or something, mm-hmm. and he was like, "They wouldn't do that for me." <laughs> like, <laughs> he was just winging it. That was, I mean, again, I don't want to sound too pro Trump, but that was a good speech. He did great. He did good. He did yeah. good. I thought he did good, dude. But I you, mean, it was it was standard fucking like a lot of dumb. I mean, there was a fucking female, like a girl cancer survivor. The way they do it to explain each policy, they bring in somebody. Yeah, like they brought in a family who their grandparents got murdered by MS thirteen. Stop, and dude. Then Congress clapped for them. <laughs> MS thirteen killed like two eighty year olds. Did they in really? their house? Yeah, it's fucking hilarious. Do you think six nine had any connection with it? Takashi, he snitched, dude. For sure, he snitched. He's been snitching. You know dude, that. Think about MS thirteen breaking into your nan and pap's house and icing them, dude. What I a mean, sick way to go. Imagine, <laughs> imagine though, watching How hyped Fox your grandpa News was. your whole life, <laughs> and your grand, your little fucking granddaughter's like, "Grandpa, turn this shit off, isn't it? That yeah. right?" And all of a sudden, MS thirteen breaks real. in and murders you, dude. <laughs> That guy must have been like, yes, yes, dude, yes. What a fucking that guy for for five minutes while they were breaking in, he was Clint Eastwood. Oh, he dude. was finally an old white man, just like, not my house, <laughs> not my country, you dirty sons of bitches. And then he got, you know, he got murdered. <laughs> but yeah, he was definitely like, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> hey guys, <laughs> but that's that's how I want to die. I hope I'm MS-13. eighty. I'm hope I'm eighty years old. Me and my bitch are just watching TV again. Definitely. A bunch of fucking cholos break in and ice that's us. That's a good, dude. that's an honorable death. Just dude. to steal like our plates or whatever valuables <laughs> they had. <laughs> now, I wonder what they, a lot of geezers aren't really like, ah, a lot of times there's a little bit of cash squirrels. Yeah. The guy could have been the juice man, dude. You think he was the he juice? He might have been selling pills, dude. Oh, yeah, they probably got some pills dude, out of Dude, old those people geezers. have so many fucking pills, dude. Yeah. Those MS 13 made out like bandits that night. That guy might have been Poppy. You think? He might have been the plug. You think that geezer was the plug? He might have been the plug, dude. <laughs> they might have stormed the plug. That's probably, I mean, they don't just ice random geezers. That's what I'm saying. That was a fucking plug. Oh, that's what they do, Shane. <laughs> just ice they random geezers. They come in geezers. here and they rape and kill old people. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> They're real big I mean, that was his rape. message. He was like, this is what happened to these old people. They get raped and murdered by a couple Mexicans. <laughs> <They> actually, have- <laughs> <laughs> That's fucking nuts. Oh, my God. <laughs> At one point, in uh, just a, he was talking about uh, Venezuela, and he was like, "Used to be, used to be a beautiful country. Socialism has ruined it." And he's like, "I want everyone here to make the pledge: we will never be a socialist country." And of course, the Republicans stand up and clap, and then well, the, the camera, Democrats say, the camera just zooms in on you- Bernie Sanders, who's sitting there like <laughs> 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 Trump. Trump out of nowhere in the middle of the speech was just like. We're not communists. We'll never be communists. Next topic. We're going to the moon. Next topic. It was fucking wild. That's Terrific. awesome. We're going back yeah. to the moon. Yeah, dude. he had Buzz Aldrin up in the That's rafters. He was like, yo, shout Aldrin out Buzz. Aldrin loves Aldrin's out of his fucking <laughs> gourd, dude. He was wearing like a mini American tie. It came up to like his nipples. <laughs> <laughs> he stood up and was like, <laughs> he saluted him with these bug eyes. Oh my God. You gotta dude. watch it. I'm going to check well, that out. Watch the State of the Union. Get high and watch that tonight. For sure. You're going to be like, be holy fantastic. shit, this is chaos. The last thing I saw was Pelosi and Schumer talking to Trump, and I was like, I'm, I checked Pelosi out. Pelosi and Schumer's post-Trump, their rebuttal was one of the gayest fucking things. What did they ever say? Well, it was that, that was the night, the one you're talking about, where they both stood at the podium together. I was talking about when they went into his office like months ago, and oh. they were like, no, you shut the government down first. Like, well, yeah. I did it, but like not as long as you shut the government. It was like... It's a bunch of fucking old people losing their yeah. minds. Like, what the <laughs> right, fuck? Yeah. They, they do a... The other party has a response. 
after the oh, State of the State Union. Union. State of the Boolean, dude. Yeah, dude. We're like, yeah, did you hear that? Trump's ever going to... The the Democrats had a power move, dude. They had a black lady, fat black lady, standing at a podium. Fuck. All women of different races behind her on, like, a bleachers. Oh, Fuck. My God. And she stood there and was like, my dad worked at a factory. My mom was a librarian. America is great. Like it was just like I mean it's the same thing as bringing up to fucking yeah, like a, the, the grandchildren of an MS thirteen yeah. murdered. Dude, that's I was that's that is I mean stuff that's not a new conclusion, but like to watch people watch the same thing and have two very different Crazy. reactions to it is fucking nuts. I mean, yes, if, if somebody watched the State of the Union was like Trump's a fucking loser and he's this is crazy, I'd be like, yeah, of course, yeah, yeah. Trump. But I watched it. And I was like, Trump daddy, dude. Yeah, but, I mean, jokingly, I was like, he fucking killed it. It's crazy that people will watch. Like, you're watching it. You're like, all right, Trump's fucking bringing up vets. He's, you're seeing <laughs> yeah, the fucking yeah, yeah. tricks that right. are being played. Easily. And for some, someone to watch it and be like, I can't believe you brought them up. And they're like watching the other lady like, eh, nothing to see here. Right, right. Yeah, watching like, yeah, it. Fucking nuts, dude. The exactly. The yeah. totally diverse bleacher of women behind this black like the, lady the giving a speech. hand selected, dude. Oh, right. absolutely. They hand select them at fucking comedy specials. Yeah, man. That's weird. It's weird as you fuck. You ever see that? I, I, I assume that. They do that. Yeah. When you get to a comedy special taping, they decide who sits in the front row. Like, while people are walking in, they'll look at the audience and be like, all right, you two, come up here. And it'll be like a biracial couple. Right. Perfect. they be like, you, black chicks, get up front. Like, it's it's wild. Yeah, they want to see it like that diverse reaction and stuff. Yeah. It's That's funny. pretty crazy. Watch, uh, go to HBO when you get a chance and watch Amanda Seals. Uh, fuck, I don't think that's her name. I forget who it is. Amanda Bynes? No, it might. It's Amanda Bynes. <laughs> Fuck, I, I shouldn't be just trashing someone now that I'm in the yeah, fucking... You're just talking I'm about, just in the industry. Talking about the, yeah. You're talking about the production. But uh, no, just go watch it. There's a, I think it's Amanda Seals. Yeah. You're not trashing her. You're and she's trashing like, the Well, now you're trashing person. her. Yeah, fuck it. At the beginning of the special... <laughs> you were Yeah. I'd, if I met her, I'd be like, yeah, it's nice to meet you. But, uh, I love you. Uh, at the beginning of the special, she's walking through like on her cell phone, walking up to the stage. She's like, this special is not for homophobes. Oh. This ain't for racists. This ain't for Trump fans. This ain't for... like." She just names all these things. Yeah. She's like, you ain't... If this ain't for fuck boys, this ain't... It's just like... Man, that sucks. Just... So while I was watching that, I was like, all right, I'm out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I guess I'm...